Every day inside this barn, they see miracles. A ride around the horse, he walks along. Meet James, an autistic four-year-old who struggles to communicate. When he was 15 months, he started throwing temper tantrums that were about 45 minutes to an hour and a half long, and nothing at all would console him. On. James is one of the many clients that uses the hippotherapy program, one of the methods therapists and volunteers are starting to turn to. How has this helped James? James came to us nonverbal, totally nonverbal, wasn't able to have good eye contact, which is one of the problems with children with autism. Through the program, autistic children like James learn different exercises to better their everyday lives. Even today with James, I, I think I've only um, worked his lessons um, a few times, but just seeing the progress that he's made and when he said elephant. Elephant. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> it, yeah, it's just every little thing. It's the littlest thing. So it's lateral movements like this that help kids like James who have autism to help stimulate those motor skills and even the senses that they need to function on a daily basis. And James Whoa, progress isn't Lord. unique. Volunteers at Step say they've seen children experience their first words. His father filmed the whole thing, a 45 minute lesson filled the whole thing. And uh, at the end, we took him down and we said, do you want to say bye to Bert? And he actually looked up at him and said, Bert. And his father dropped the camera. I, we all just lost it. Go, Bert. This is a life's mission for me. This, if, it, if this is all I did for the rest of my life, I'd be so happy. It's very rewarding. It's the best thing I've ever done in my life, seriously. In Glenville, Jennifer Mullen, CBS 6 News.